Yes. And so our last hunt together in October of 1987, <laughs> it's so emotional. He, was in, he had an oxygen tank and we walked down the lanes together. Everybody else was bow hunting. And I just tried to sponge the man, the, the, the vision, the, the strength, the fortitude, the goodwill, the, 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 the decency. And he thanked me for promoting bow hunting in a world of rock and roll that was anti-hunting, animal rights insanity. And he said he watched my interviews and everywhere he went, people asked him about Ted Nugent because I have a big mouth and I saw the animal rights people infiltrating the media. So I'd fight back. I wouldn't just, well, I'm not going to get involved. No, I'm going to get involved. And I fought back and Fred thanked me. So that next uh, April, he died. God damn it. I'm in my barn right now and there's pictures of Fred. And there's bows that he gave me, and I shot my bow this morning. It's so crazy how emotional people can be. So I got up that morning, and I went to give my dogs their biscuits. And instead, I picked up the guitar, and I just started. I didn't know what was going on, but I just went... <laughs> <laughs> 